Thank you, Mayor Andrew. I wasn't going to say anything, but um, why not? Everybody else is, right? Um, so this has gone... I think everyone knows, knows my position on this and how I'm not taking this as seriously as everybody else because I don't think this is actually a big deal. I don't. I don't understand why it's a big deal. Um, but I will collectify some of the points here, um, which some of them may be a little bit out there, but have a think about it. Iwi and Hapu do not talk for Māori. Māori talk for Māori. Iwi and Hapu talk for Iwi Hapu. There's a difference, and there is a, and there's a fundamental difference. We're probably going to see around um, somewhere in the region of 12 to 13,000 Māori people in our district. People like my family, who fuck up up the river, who have not stepped one foot in a marae, and won't. They are Māori. Their DNA markers are fuck up up back to Māori. But they do not go to the marae, talk to the hapu, talk to the iwi. So hapu iwi do not talk for them. Māori talk for Māori. And I want to be very clear that the Local Government Act is very clear in the difference between Māori and iwi hapu. So you can go through the Local Government Act and you can search them and you can see very clearly the Treaty of Waitangi on Section 4 says that we must have participation by Māori. In other words, you must, as elected officials, go and talk to your constituents irrelevant of their ethnicity. So you should be going out there right now talking to everybody. Uh, we have 4% Indian, we have 4% um, Asian, we have 4.4% uh, Polynesian, uh, we have um, a very large growing uh, Eastern European bloc coming in here. You should be talking to all of them, getting perceptions from everybody. So I'll put it very, very clear. Uh, I've been very insulted by saying more representation. It's like you're saying to me that I don't represent those people. So I'm ignoring the 9,000 Māori because I'm Pākehā. I find it extremely insulting and I um, just want to make it very clear that I'm very insulted because I do represent those people. Um, Māori to share views. Every person on the council should be obtaining views. So when they say about perspectives, you should be getting perspective. That's good governance. If you're not being a good governor, that's on you. Treaty is about iwi chiefs, not the people. So when we say honour thy treaty, um, this is Māori wards, not iwi wards. This is not mana whenua, this is tangana whenua. So Māori wards, have, for me, and I've had a great discussion with a friend of mine around this, uh, a couple of friends of mine actually around this, and I'm still not clear that uh, the treaty has any say in Māori wards. This is Māori wards, not iwi wards. Um, I'm very interested in what happens when the 3,500 voters uh, are no longer voting in general. It's going to be very interesting because a lot of people here have a, a, a good Māori worldview, um, and you're voted by you're voted on by three and a half thousand people voting for Māori who will not be there next election. So it's going to be very interesting to see what happens. So I'm, I'm, I'm up or down on that. Um, I go back to my original thing I said to a friend of mine a few months ago. If I wanted to keep minority in their place, if I wanted to be dodgy, if I wanted to say, you know what, how do we? make it out that we can keep people quiet, I would introduce Māori wards. i do that because there would be, they'd have two votes out of 12, and my people would have 10 out of 12. So I've always been very against Māori wards. Uh, however, I am big on democracy. This was a simple system. Uh, it should have been a very simple thing. We went out to referendum and said, hey, do you want wards based on electoral roll? Not Māori wards, because everyone gets confused between Māori wards and Māori wardens, apparently. Um, do you want a ward system on electoral roll? Is that what you wanted? And the fact I've got my numbers in front of me uh, on my spreadsheet. Yes, you did. You wanted it. So today I'm voting for it because I vote for the people what you want. If you did not want this, you should have come and said you did not want this. Um, I've spoken to over 300 myself personally, people who could be on a Māori roll. And over 58% of those have stated that they want Māori wards. Well, if you want Māori wards, then you should have Māori wards. It's not my decision. It's yours. So, although I disagree with some of your positions, everyone, I respect them nonetheless. And um, thank you. <laughs>